April, you need to mute the YouTube channel in the background. Okay, what did I get right or what did I get wrong? I I can hear you, April. What no. did I get right or what did I get wrong? I was going to uh hi. I was going to uh speak on You need to turn off the YouTube. Hello. Who is an eight or a nine? Pam Greer is an eight. Um, oh, I'm sorry. I'm trying to run a show, Chick. April, you need to unmute yourself. You need to unmute yourself on Zoom, and you need to shut the YouTube channel oh. down in the background. Go ahead. So there we go. Did, did I do that? Yeah. So what do I have right, did or I, what do I have wrong? I was just going to speak on about uh, some African American men. A lot of times they want you to take care uh, of them. What, what the hell does that have to do with the subject we're talking about? About women who are sevens, eights, nine, and accurate rank, and ranking themselves. That's the subject tonight. Because I think a lot do of you have yeah, something. Do, do you have something on that subject? Do you have something? I'm trying do to. Do you have something on that subject? Well, women that are those the numbers that you gave were like six through seven. A lot of times they You got YouTube playing in the background, ma'am. I don't know how to turn this off. Okay. I have no idea. Close the window that has YouTube playing. Okay, do you have YouTube playing in the background? Or put on a headset or something like that. Oh man. Well, yeah, you got to come prepared to the show. Yeah, I got to hit. So my question is this. You oh, wanted to yeah. basically come in and, and roast black men. What's wrong with them? No, 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 no. Not at all. Mm -hmm. I wanted to get, because a lot of times they, you know, were judged by um, how we look. Yeah. And um, I, 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 I understand. Uh -huh. I understand it. Mm -hmm. Do you think women should be judged by how they look? I put on the Do you think women should be judged how they, by how they look? Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah. Well, no, I didn't want to roast them. Okay. You, I didn't want to roast them. Yeah. See, what you're doing, ma'am, is yeah, you're behind. She's behind. Uh, she's watching. She's listening to the YouTube stream. And the YouTube is 30 oh, minutes right, behind, right, 30 right. seconds behind. So I've told her to shut down YouTube, but she, you still to won't it. do it. Um, oh, but man. uh, yeah, and now I think a lot of men do that, and I think they're not looking beyond looks because looks fade. No, yes. but no, but who, but looks is what we want, ma'am. Looks is what we want when we have our means and money. That's what they want. Yeah, I can't figure out how to. Mm -hmm. And I don't know how to get it all. Well, you know. That's something y'all we're gonna have to figure out now. You gotta figure out how to work YouTube and Zoom and everything. You're gonna be calling into the shows. Got it. Oh man. I you, okay, you have that. you have you got are you on a laptop? Yes. Okay, do you are you watching the YouTube show? Are you watching the show? No, I I, I thought I clicked it okay, off. Okay, but when you look in the browser windows, you should be able to see if you if the show is still playing. But that's okay. Let's go. Um oh. you hear me right now, right? Okay, right, so yes. men should not, we're talking about, do women accurately rank or rate themselves? And you were going to tell me, Do answer that question first before you say what you were going to say. Do women accurately rank themselves? I think so. They're encouraging themselves because a lot of media is just saying how ratchet we are, how... how okay, we, how but we uh, act, okay, how, how about, we, how about, I mean, I'm talking about horrible. individual women. Like, how would you rank yourself? On a scale of one to ten. Seven. seven. You rank yourself as a seven. How old are you? No, I mean, just for my sake. Can't say because I'm actually in, 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 in law school. Okay, so but you're a seven. I'm going to have to pass on but that. But you're a seven. Say that you're, again? You rank yourself as a seven. Yes. Okay, so 
A seven is like Thelma on Good Times. You remember Thelma Hopkins, as fine as she was? I look, to give you an actual, I look like Sharon Lil. I have the same Who's um, that? nose, same, um, I have a dimple in the head. Uh-huh. I um, have like a, a beauty mark on right. my nose. So I, you know, mm-hmm. and I have a lot of professors, they just stop and they look at me like they can't believe mm-hmm. it. And I'm like, are you kidding yeah, cause me? Yeah, because you, you're fine. You know, you're looking at black women like you've never right. seen. So you're, you're are like, you, what city, what state saying. do you live in? Well, I was up in Massachusetts, but I'm in New Jersey. In Jersey now. So okay. Uh, South how Jersey, tall are you? South. Oh, five, four. And about how much do you weigh on a good day? 130. And you were seven. You should be killing the yeah, game. 133. I'm a little old. You should be killing the game. It, well, they want you to look fly. And I don't But a seven fly. is, for, but a so fly, but seven is, one. seven is, Thelma was pretty. You said you were seven. Yeah. I, a lot of, a lot of them, they want you fly. They want you to take care right, well, of No, them. no, 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 no. We're not going to talk about what you talking, who, who you talk about. See, over here. I don't talk about dusty dudes. Over here, I talk about men who are making about $125,000 a year for themselves. Men who, if they take on a wife and kids, they can afford to her not to have to ever work and still have three babies and send them kids to college. That's this show. I don't want to hear shit about dusty dudes that, that maybe you have had run across. Talk to me about what those men want. Uh oh! Oh, I'm not. I haven't Uh-oh. been around those men. Uh oh! Okay. Well, how, why ain't you been around them? Don't they exist? Oh yeah. I then why? why so so here's what I got to understand. April is that those men if those men exist and you know they exist and you ain't going to law school, right? Yeah. Why the hell are you around all these dusty dudes if you know these other dudes exist and you're in law school? Because gotcha, I basically just started. I haven't been in there, you know, like two two years or three years. You ain't twelve years old. No, not at all. So, so what? You know what I tend to hear when I hear women say this kind of stuff. What I tend to hear is women like that tend to tend to have a narrative, and they got to have a narrative that works. That you know these guys ain't crap. That's why I ain't got one. I don't have one because these men ain't about shit. They all dusty and want you to take care of them and all this other stuff. But see, that ain't what we got going on over here. I, I, you know, I hear you and. It's, it's a shame. It's really a shame that. It's a shame a what? Of, um, it's a shame. That, that it's a shame. Do, do these. Okay, let me give you some stats. 51% of black men are single and childless. You got that? 64% of black men are in the middle class. That means if you're dealing with dusty, busty men that want you to take care of them, it ain't because black men don't exist, it's because you can't attract them other ones. Huh? I said, and I have no children, so okay. I mean, it's just, it's just. Really you got no kids, and why? If you if you got no kids, and you were seven, and in law school, why can't you? Fine. Because a, lot be- of, because a lot of those men have ready-made children. A ready-made okay. Well, uh, well no, ma'am, 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 ma'am. Okay, yes. go back again. Fifty-one percent of them have no children. That means more than half of black men are have no kids. So you keep talking about the minority. I got the stats, ma'am. Go to blackdemographics.com. Fifty-one percent no kids. Single. I know and you have seventy percent of black women who are not married. Fact. But and, and but 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 the point is, ma'am, I'm asking you, why you keep talking about these guys got ready made families when over half of them have no kids? Talk to me about the ones that have no kids and are in the middle class. Talk to me about those. Stop talking to me about these dusty dudes. Talk to me about the ones with no children and are in the middle class. I honestly don't see him. It's it's the way you don't see him. You don't see him. And you a seven. These men love sevens. I don't see them. Mm, These men love sevens. They love them sevens. Boy, I swear to God. Yeah, but they all have children. It's just about. It just amazes me. They all have kids, man. They all have kids, right? No, I don't have any. No. No, you said they all have kids. You mean yeah. every man you meet has kids? 
It just I I can't understand it. Uh, I, 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 hey, bro. Hey, bro. I, I'm I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Oh my God, my God. I'm gonna tell you why a lot of these guys have kids. Cause you're going to the wrong places to meet the wrong kind of guys. You get, you don't meet none of these men in law school. Yeah, I see, and they have kids, children. <laughs> really? So every man yeah. you meet in law school got kids. It's, it's 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 just the majority of them. Uh uh-uh, uh, the majority of black men have no single and childless. Stop tell, stop lying. Stop no, lying. I'm t- oh, I'm just talking about on the at the law school that I'm at. So oh, okay, so what law school is that? Law and school of deadbeat nigga. School of law. So, so that, and that's the school that no, enrolls deadbeats. It's, um, it's a lot of Africans there. It's um. Oh, okay. African Americans there. Okay, but then, but you live in the city. With, but you live in the city with. Okay, so apparently, April, you have found a law school that enrolls deadbeats to become deadbeat attorneys. Congratulations on accomplishing something that I have never heard of before. But I know a lot of it. Matter of fact, I have several clients who just graduated from law school. I know younger men. I know men in their 30s. I know men in their 40s and 50s. Still single, childless. But if you are, but you still ain't talked to me about the men that you like and that approach you up in Massachusetts. I mean, you are seven. A seven as a woman with no kids should have plenty of attraction, should have some decent men, right? That's true, you would think, but it's not but, like that. It, right? I know no luck, huh? It's not like that. Well, I, I don't know what to tell you, but do you think maybe, just maybe, do you think it could be maybe you're not a seven? Not at all. Not if you look like Sharon Little. No, 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 no. I'm saying you. I mean, I know Sharon Sharon Little. That's what I'm saying. Me. But you, but, but you are, you are. It. So it's not. It's not. It's not at all that you could just be average looking, right? No. Right. If you if you look like Sharon Little, no. Okay. Um, but but so the problem ain't how you look. It's the problem is. That, that that you know. Then I'm not fly. That's the problem. It's not After fly. Men, a lot not of fly. fly. I don't so, have the look. I don't have the behavior. None of that. But but the look yeah. is a seven, though, man. Yeah, but that that it, it's not a fly look. It's just I look very young to people. They can't believe it. They just look you, at me like you look. You know, I mean, yeah. I mean, you know, young looking women. I know. I mean, young looking women. I mean, especially if an older woman and you're younger looking, yeah, it's, it's kind of confusing for men. I don't well, get it. Really, because I, I, they look at me like stunned. Right. I'm thinking, what kind of stunned? Is this? Hey, bro. Stunned. What? Oh my God! I just stunned. Like you've never seen anybody black. And I, they they just young. never seen that amount of beauty. I mean, if you're a seven and a, and a and a sister in law school in your late forties or fifties, I mean, it's not common to see a lot of you know women that look like Sharon Little. That's like pretty and Sharon shit, right? Little. Yeah, Sharon Little. Mm-hmm. Oh my God! Yeah, but you got Janet Jackson. I mean, you got a whole lot of yeah. People. You look like Janet Jackson too. No, I'm just saying. No, no, I'm saying you you have people like her who look young, right? Look great. Hmm. So right. I'm just—I don't understand that. You don't it's understand it. Shame. Well, you know—you know what? Some brother out there is missing out. Some brothers out there. So when you're out and about uh, and doing your thing, uh, how do you dress when you go out? I have pants on okay. a lot of times. I mm-hmm. might wear skirts every now and do you, then. Do you wear? For do you, safety reason. Do you, yeah, okay, for safety reasons. I'm not reasons. familiar with Massachusetts, and I don't know. Okay, so you don't want to wear skirts because you don't want somebody booping you over your head and taking your goodies. No, because I've had situations where I've had men follow me into the bathroom. Okay, I, well, you know, gotta be safe. God, I, I mean, I when you when you when you're fine, chance. you gotta be safe. But do you um do you like uh wear a lot of makeup or do you just what? I wear no makeup. I mm. wear cocoa butter. Mm. That's it. No makeup. Cocoa butter's good for you. Keep your face shine. What about you know? Do you wear your natural hair or do you wear it up or what? I wear like I wear like uh in a hump kind of like you know in a hump. Let's get yeah, over the it's hump. Not, it's kind of like a don't. French roll kind of thing. Kind What's of a look? French roll? A French roll on a, like a baguette? Say that one more time. A French roll like a baguette? You wear your hair on a baguette? 
No, not, but it's, it's just like a hump, like in the front. A, a hump. bump. Yeah, like a, yeah, a bump. A, a bump. Is it let's yeah. get over the hump or let's do the bump? Which one is it? The bump. Uh, the bump. Like you wear a bump hump. Head, like a bun. You wear uh, a French like, bump hump. Okay. Yeah. A French bump hump baguette. Okay. So you got on pants in, in Massachusetts because you yeah. don't know the area because you're not got to be safe. Right. That's Instead of wearing them skirts and stuff, be. and you got to put the cocoa butter on because you know that keeps you glit, you know, soft and you know, supple. And then you get over the getting over the hump, the hump bump, whatever it is, you know, it's just yeah. you know, but but you're still looking like Sharon Little when you're out there going to law school, and you just can't figure right. out why you can't find, you know, you know, Boaz and shit, because yeah, you know. but I mean it. it it's like they kind of put all African American women together, and yeah, and it's, yeah, it's it's you know, all you know, them. You, you're April, you, you right, you April, shame. and it's terrible because it, all they keep doing this to you. They keep classifying all. They say you all the same. It can't be. Yeah. It, ain't, it ain't you. It's them. You all ratchet. All these, di- and then they, and then even worse, they got all them kids and all this other stuff. I mean, it's hard out there for a sister. It really is. I know uh, you kind of, kind of don't think so, but you'll find out. No, uh, I believe you. I believe you. So what happened when the white men come approach you? Because since the black men ain't shit. No, I that's the group I don't go with, and they always come up and approach. Oh me. yeah, it's well, just of course, Brad. Okay, so Brad sweating you too. What about when uh uh Enrique or uh Ahmed or when uh. Uh, Lee or you mean those Arabs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. When, too, yeah. Okay, so you got them all coming at so you. I don't. Blake I don't. Henry all up in your spot. Mm-hmm. Not, not them. No. Right. So, and, so and when they come at you, you ain't got no, you got no, got no game for them either, huh? Waldo and them just can't get. I speak up. to them. I mean, right. I'm nice to them. So, be, it must, so let me get this right, brothers. You can't find a brother on your level. And you and then you get these other folks and you're not into the white dudes, which I feel you. No. And Enrique and the Hispanic dude and the Middle Eastern dude, you ain't feeling them and the Asian dude. So well, I mean what's next? I mean, ain't I mean I mean, I know you ain't thinking about going to get a girl, are you? I mean I mean is it, No, no, no. Well, I wasn't raised like that. Well, no. so what so well shit, you know, well I'm sorry, sis. You know, I thought I could try to help you, but you know, I, when you covering all your bases like this, and you just can't find a dude out there, you know, sometimes you know, you know, like old girl said, God has His perfect will, and maybe you know, maybe it's just not for you right now. I, 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 That's true. I, That's I, true. I, I don't know what else to say. Oh, okay. But I appreciate you calling well, in. Thank you for taking that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, all the best, and you know, you stay out there safe with that humps in the bump, and them pants and the cocoa butter and shit, and you know, get your JD so you can be the prize. All right, all right thank then. You so much. All right then. All right then. With your Bye-bye. fine ass, get up out of here. Don't break no hearts, baby girl. Mm-hmm. <laughs>